So I was in a pinch with the AT89 S52 and this morning I thought well I haven't tried everything so I gave this setup uh, another chance and it seems to have uh, solved the problem. This is a code I've running, this is a green LED and this one this is a green LED and this one is a blue LED and with each button press, I have a button here, uh, the green LED toggles state and for each five um, button presses this uh, blue LED changes state. So one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, yeah, it works. Now, when the problem arised when I uh, toggled the power on and off, so, uh, but now it works perfectly each and every time. And this is because I've noticed that the problem arises when uh, the power is uh, turned off and on again so there must be something wrong with the uh, power on reset function so I started googling around and surely enough I found the solution and it's adding this 10, capa uh, 10 microfarad capacitor from VCC to uh, reset pin and that seems to have solved the problem that I was facing and it ha both of the chips have uh, uh, performed equally uh, good in this setup and I can turn off the power but I just switch the mains AC off and yeah it works one, two, three, four, five. So, yeah, I also made um, circuit for eighty, uh, eighty-nine development board, and it is. So there's still some modifying to do, but. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go ahead and uh, make a development board with this uh, IC and I take back everything I've said bad for uh, bad about this because clearly I was the stupid one um, who, who didn't have the proper connections so yeah I don't get it. I mean, I saw the capacitor, but I, I just decided not to add it. Why? I don't know. Anyway, so that problem uh, has been dealt with with this capacitor. Thanks for watching.